I'm gonna start this weekend's vlog with a quick little spring haul because I've been doing some retail therapy, much needed. I personally love seeing little hauls and seeing like what kind of unique pieces people have found on the internet that I can buy myself. So please feel free to like steal not steal. You know what I'm trying to say. Feel free to take anything you like here. I don't buy it. Like I love wearing the same things as people. I hate when there's girls that are like, oh my god, I can never wear the same thing as someone else. Like, oh my god, embarrassing. It's not that embarrassing. It's really not. It's like, oh my god, we wore the same thing. Like, great minds think alike. So I got some things from Revolve and the first top I want to show you, I've been in love with. I haven't worn it yet because I want to have like a perfect little brunch springtime occasion. Look at it. It's like a pretty little purple lacy, kind of like a corset. Like it has the nice like cinching in the back. I really like elegant, sweet little pieces. It's like cute and flirty. I guess that could be my perfect definition. Like if I could have a perfect closet, I want it to be cute and flirty. Next, going in the theme of bright spring colors, I got this really cute yellow kind of crochet halter neck from Revolve as well. This is from the brand More To Come. The only thing is it's actually a little see-through, so I'm gonna have to wear like nipple pasties, but I love this top. I'm so excited to wear this in the summer as well. I feel like just such a beautiful, perfect, cute little crop top for the spring, for any warm season. I'm just gonna show you all the bright colored things first because I feel like that fits spring the most. And this bodysuit is like the perfect color for spring. It gives me like Easter yellow. Yellow. I don't know. I thought I was worried about looking a little bit like an egg in it, but it actually looks really good on me. I think the color is super flattering. I don't know. I recently found out I might be like a spring color palette tone. So I'm trying and experimenting with like a lot more pastels. Okay, the next one. I was so worried about how this would look on, but I think it looks super sexy. I don't know why I said it like that, but I just think this is a really cute corset situation. I'm not one to wear a lot of like corsets or bustiers, but I really, really like this one. Also in the going out top department, I got this really cute triangular, nice satin shirt. I don't know if this is satin, but it has that like beautiful kind of like satin finish. And I also got this very basic bodysuit that's just like bando kind of bodysuit, but at least it goes all the way down. I think it's just a good like basic to have to match with pretty much anything, so that's why I got this, and I do think it looks really flattering on. Also from Revolve, I got these really, really cute heels. I'm in love with the type of like design where it just like ties around your ankle, like a little ballerina slipper. I think it's just so cute. Okay, now that we have the Revolve stuff out of the way, I also wanna show you what I got from Anthropology. This is just like a small haul, but I went there out of random with Anne, who my housemate, best friend who I live with, and I don't know, I just saw these shorts and I thought, I don't have any shorts in like a darker blue. And then just for fun, I got myself like a bunch of little bralettes. They had like two for $40, beautiful kind of tie knot in the front, like two colors. And then I also got this bralette that was on sale and it has cute little hearts on it. And it's just like, I love, I don't wear padded bras anymore. If I ever wear a bra, it's like something like this, just to kind of like, I guess hide the, the nipple or I don't know just like make things look more together but I hate wearing bras these are just so fun though like look at the beautiful it's so cute okay now with the haul out of the way I have to start packing because I'm leaving for Orange County in like an hour or less I want to get there ASAP I'm all packed and then this is my quick little breakfast. I have like hard boiled eggs and this avocado toast with Cholula and then peanut butter and banana. I also made myself a quick little coffee with that caramel creamer I've been loving.
lunch, which was that poke burrito, so good. Me and Lexi went for a walk and just like stretched our legs and helped our stomachs digest a little more. And then this night we were supposed to go to a concert, so this was my fit, but the concert got canceled last minute. So I changed and we prepared to go out for just like drinks and stuff. at dinner our waiter gave us these little flowers and he said thank you for making my night it was so sweet After lunch, it was time to get ready for a birthday party, and my friend Christina did my makeup because I'm so bad at it before we left. <laughs> I don't like this. Okay, I, I absolutely hate this. <laughs> We came to this outdoor loungy kind of bar called The Bungalow and it was just so fun getting to like talk with friends, sip little cocktails and celebrate this beautiful girl. The next morning, Christina and I went on a walk in the upper part of Back Bay in Newport and I'll drop the link in the description if you ever want to walk here. It's such a nice like Sunday activity idea. And we got a little Instagram versus reality moment. But then after our walk, we went out to brunch and I got this really good chicken club sandwich that had bacon and some cheese. And of course I had to steal some sweet potato fries. And later that afternoon, I made the two hour drive back home to Santa Barbara. This was such a fun weekend, but it was so nice to get home and slip back into my comfortable bed. But thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you in the next vlog.